My hair does some really crazy things at three in the morning, doesn't it? How's it going, everybody? My name's Sugar Cat. Welcome to the echoey, billowy halls of my work. It's 3 a.m. And unfortunately, even though tomorrow is Sunday, I'm unable to do a live stream as tomorrow is my dad's birthday and we're all going out for dinner. And since I get off work at 8 a.m. and I'm back in here at 6 p.m., I'm not gonna have a whole lot of time to do much of anything. So I decided to reach out to you guys and ask, hey, what would you guys want to know about me other than the fact that my hair is going absolutely wild? So I got a big old list of questions here that I'm gonna try to ramble through them so that you guys can maybe learn something about me and maybe we'll have some fun at the same time. First question is, favorite song? Now, song of all time, it would probably have to be a song called Tuna in the Brine by Silverchair. That song has a lot of special meaning to me, and it was at a pretty dark time in my life, and it kind of got me through it, and it's a very good tune. If you, if you know of Silverchair, and you only know of their earlier grungy Seattle rock that everybody wants them to go back to, go listen to the album Diorama, and to a lesser extent, Neon Ballroom. They are uh, masterpieces of work. Daniel Johns is an incredible writer. If I could meet any celebrity for a day, living or dead, and hang out with them, probably either be John Lennon or Freddie Mercury. I think Freddie would be a more wild time. I think he'd know how to party. First thing I will do upon monetization, have a big old celebration party, that's what I'll do. Uh, probably set up the Patreon, try to get the channel actually rolling down this hill so that I can leave this and actually do what I want to do for a living. That would be amazing. Marvel or Star Wars universe? Probably the Star Wars universe since the entire Marvel universe was just half eliminated. Ooh. Fantasy pet. Fangirl in Discord said, that she'd choose an alicorn. And I think I agree with that, except for the fact that I wouldn't keep them as a pet, I'd befriend them and we'd all have a giant unicorn party. If I could go back and change one thing, what would it be? There's a lot that I would go back and change. Um, I, I've done a lot of terrible things in my life and I've hurt a lot of people. This was a while ago, a long time ago, in my younger days and I feel like I could have been a much better person to people, and I could have treated them better and not used them as much, and I would like to go back and rectify my wrongs and treat people how they should be treated. And I implore all of you to become better people and grow from it and learn from it. It definitely helps. Fantasy weapon, the infinity gauntlet. If I could have three wishes, what would they be? To live forever, for everyone that I care about to live forever, and for everyone to be healthy. That'd be amazing. Keep everyone that I love beside me and we just live forever. I mean, the earth will eventually be destroyed by the sun, but if you live forever, we can just float through space anyway to the next planet, we'll be all be fine. Tattoo. I don't have any, I'm going to be getting some. Probably on the trip coming up, I'm gonna be getting one. I'm gonna be getting something probably either on this forearm or this one. Uh, it's gonna be the Departures logo from the television show. Uh, that show has a very special meaning to me and my friends because it's what inspired us to start traveling in the first place. And on the other side, I want to get the ballroom dancers from Neon Ballrooms, the Silver Chair album. They, they both would mean so much to me. If I was banned from YouTube, what platform would I go to? I would go to Twitch. If I could be any fantasy race, what would I be? I'd be an elf. Magic and all that. Where to live in the entire world if I could live anywhere? Either Australia or London. I'm a huge lover of everything in the UK. Probably would live in London. Which three people for the zombie apocalypse? Mugdock, Mugdock, and Mugdock. Because it, it says they wouldn't include family or like... I don't know if it included family or friends, I just wrote down family, so I'm gonna say it doesn't include friends. Mugduck is a nutcase when it comes to weaponary things. He would have like trebuchets and crossbows and stuff. He'd be the one to get me through the zombie apocalypse. If I can get a shout out from anybody, could I? who would I get it from? Probably Jacksepticeye, because everybody says PewDiePie, but Poods has a lot of um, controversy surrounding him, and I don't really want my name attached to that at the moment. Jack's community is more like mine, and I feel like I would benefit more from his community. If I could eat without getting fat, what would it be? Pizza. Easy. A uh, villain or superhero Marvel Universe, I would be Doctor Strange, because Doctor Strange is amazing. If not them, probably Wolverine. Mansion or a yacht? A yacht I could 
float wherever I wanted to go in the entire world and do whatever I wanted to do. Would I rather be happy and dumb or smart but sad? Happy and dumb because I'd rather live my life to the fullest and be happy. Doesn't matter if you're smart. Smartness doesn't get you far in the world nowadays. Being happy does. All right, that was about 20 questions I just ran through right there. It's not the most entertaining video of the entire week, but I apologize. I'm not really good at time scheduling or fixing things up so that they've stretched out the way they're supposed to. But I do appreciate all the support that you guys are giving me. We are at 1,509, I believe, right now, which is an astonishing number. That number's way too high for what I do. But you know what? Let's push it even higher. Let's see how high we can get by the end of February. Because who doesn't want to see more of this craziness going on at three in the morning? So I'm gonna go for now. I'm gonna get back to work and do what I do so I get paid so that I can keep doing this. And I want all you guys to make sure that you hit the like and subscribe button down below. Keep eating your mouse themselves and I will see all of you in the next video. Take care guys.